In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys a brand new AI tool that can take any word search book idea you have and in minutes create a fully written and formatted KDP word search book you can publish to Amazon KDP. And actually today, I just got my first sale on a word search book I actually generated using litpal.ai. And I actually published this book very, very recently and it only has a couple of reviews. This isn't gonna be just another one of those KDP tool tutorials where I show you how to press a few buttons and generate the book. I'm also going to be showing you how to find profitable niches this quarter for that are already bringing in hundreds or even thousands of dollars per month with very little reviews because the word search niche on Amazon KDP is a niche with very low saturation in many niches and presents a huge opportunity for KDP self-publishers like us. I'll also going to be giving you free templates you can use to actually create your word search books incredibly quickly. So if you ever had an idea for a word search book or found a niche you thought you could compete in, but didn't have the time to create the book, this tool solves that exact problem. Let's get right into it. So the first thing we have to do to actually create a profitable word search book for Amazon KDP is we actually have to go to Amazon and start looking for some niches we can publish in. So if we look at this first niche right here, I found the Christmas word search book, large print niche. And as you guys can see, Kip Scout has validated this niche as profitable. And if we just scroll through some of the listings, we can see several self-published books like this one right here, bringing in thousands of dollars a month with very, very few reviews. Like this one only has 13 reviews. If we look at some of the books in here, we can see this one's doing over $6,000 a month. This one's doing 700, $5,000 a month, 1700, 1400, over a thousand on this one, 2,500, 1,600. So these books are doing incredibly well. And a lot of these are self-published. Again, I found this other one, very similar to the Christmas niche, but it's the Holidays Word Search Book Large Print niche. And as you can see, this one is also super profitable. We actually have this one right here, this self-published holiday word search doing probably around $1,000 a month at least. Another really good niche I found for you guys is the Jumbo Word Search Book Niche, which has also been rated at profitable. And this one is selling a ton of books here. This one's doing $20,000 a month, $6,000 a month, $9,000 a month, $2,000, $1,200. Wow, this one's $46,000, $3,000. Ton, a ton of books in this niche, killing it. And a lot of these are self-published, like this one right here. 28,000 VSR, only 11 reviews. So this niche is absolutely killing it. So that's just to show you guys how much demand there is for these word search books. And there's really very, very little competition as you guys are seeing. Gip Scout is rating all these niches as profitable. And I'm sure if you did a little bit of Amazon niche research, you could actually find a ton of similar niches also killing it on Amazon. So. Let's go into how exactly you can create these books. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do to actually create our books is we're gonna head over to a website called litpal.ai. And this is actually the fastest tool for creating AI word search books for Amazon KDP. Now, personally guys, I recommend you upgrade to a yearly plan because you actually save 33% off. Uh, but the monthly plans are good as well. And actually, as of recording, there is a limited time 25% off discount for new users who sign up all you have to do is answer a few questions after you sign up and you'll be eligible for that 25% off discount. Anyways, guys, let's just head over to the dashboard. And so from inside the dashboard, I'm just gonna head over to the word search generator right here. And then I'm just gonna put in my book title, theme and description. As we saw earlier, there's a lot of holidays and Christmas themed books doing incredibly well. So I'll just go ahead and make a holidays themed one. All I did is I pasted the word holidays into my title, theme and description. Uh, I set the language to English. You can also do Spanish if you want to target that niche. And there's actually even less competition in the Spanish niche, but we're just going to go with English for now. And then words for puzzle, I'll keep it at 15. And then let's make the, let's make the number of pages, 50 pages. And then we'll, we'll keep it at 15 by 15 as the grid size. Since we're going for a large print book, I actually recommend doing either 10 by 10 or 15 by 15. 20 by 20 is good if you want like a standard size page size. But since we want to target seniors in our niche, it's better to have less total like letters on the page. So that way seniors can actually see the pages easily. Anyways, guys, I'm just going to press the word search book for only 25 credits. And then as you guys can see, it is generating right here. And usually in less like less than like three minutes, it actually generates the entire book for us. In just three minutes, as you guys can see right here, it actually generated all 50 pages of my holiday themed word search book. And as you guys can see, it actually picked out some pretty good words. Anyways, the update I wanted to show you was now you can actually change 
how you display your answers. So you can either have lines like this, where there are like red and circle things around the answers, or you can do straight lines, which cross through the answers, or you can do highlighting. And basically all this does is there are just three different options you have to customize your book um, when you actually want to export the answer key. So just to show you how this works, I'll just press export PNG right there. And this will actually give me the entire fully formatted page for my word search book. And then if I press export answer key, it'll actually give me my entire answer key fully formatted for Amazon KDP. And as you guys can see, it perfectly lines up with our normal page. And it is honestly looking really good. Just to show you guys a couple of different things, we can also export it with straight lines like this. And it kind of gives you this design instead of the highlighting. Or you can do rectangles and export it like that. And it'll actually kind of like draw rectangles around the answers instead. It's really up to you and how you want to format your book. But this is just another way LitPal offers customization for your AI generated books. And LitPal actually saved me a ton of time because I didn't have to find any of the words myself. I didn't have to research for the words. I didn't have to go to any other software to format all the words for me. It did all the word research and the formatting for me as you guys just saw. So anyways, guys, I actually have this Canva templates document linked in the description of this video. It's 100% free for you guys to use these Canva templates. I just made this so it could help you guys out and help you guys to make your books incredibly quickly with AI. Anyways, if we just scroll down, you'll see the word search book template I made right here. We'll just go ahead and open this in a new tab. And then we're going to press file and then make a copy. And all that does is it basically just saves a copy of the template to our Canva account. And then all I'm going to do is I'm going to have my entire screen split screened like this. And then all I'm going to do super duper simply is I'm just going to find my first page here in LitPal. And then I'm going to press export PNG right here. And I'll drag that over to this Canva template. And I'll just drag it in like that. And just like that, my first page is already formatted using the template. Now to actually do the answer key, I'm just going to choose which style I like best. So I can choose rectangles, straight lines, or highlighting. Me personally, I'm going to be publishing this book in black and white. So I'm just going to go with the rectangles for now. But the straight lines would also work very well for black and white printing. Anyways, I'll just do rectangles and then I'll press export answer key. And then I'll just drag that in here like so. And as you can see, it's all been pre-formatted for me. I didn't have to go in myself and look for all the answers manually. It just formatted it like so and it perfectly aligns to my first page. Now I would just continue this process across the whole book. Just press export PNG, drag that over. Then I'll do the same for the answer key drag that in like so. And it's really up to you how you want to customize your book. LitPal made it super easy for you guys to just create all the content for your book. And now it's really up to you how you actually want to customize the interior for your book. So you could have all the answer keys behind every page, or you could add all the answer keys at the back of the book. So just to show you guys an example of what a manuscript generated by LitPal and formatted in the cam templates could look like. Here's an example of a Halloween themed word search I actually made and generated using LitPal. And as you can see, all I did is I just dragged in the LitPal pages like so. And then I made like a fun little festive border of different Halloween candies just around the edges. And this is just something you can do to add like a little bit of like flavor uh, to your books and to make them look a little bit nicer for the customers. The way I formatted this one is I had all of the word search activity pages in the front. And then actually at the back of the book, I actually had all of the corresponding search answer pages back here. And I just think this is probably one of the easiest and most effective ways actually create your books for KDP. So anyways, now that I've actually shown you guys how to actually create the word searches themselves, let's go ahead and create the cover. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to navigate over to the KDP cover calculator. Now this is a free tool KDP actually gives away. Anyways, I'm just going to select uh, my book specifications. So I'll just say my book specifications are paperback, black and white, white paper, left to right inches, 8.5 by 11, and then 110. Those are the settings for my book. And they might be slightly different for yours, depending on how long your book is and what you decide to do. But that's just how I'm going to make my book. So anyways, I'll just press calculate dimensions, and then it'll give me the width and the height for my book cover. So anyways, I'm going to go back into Canva, and then I'm going to create a design, and I'm going to press custom size right here, and I'll select the units to inches. And then I'll just paste in the values that I got from KDP. And then I'll just press create new design. So anyways, to actually create the cover for our book, I'm actually going to head back into LitPal AI. 
And I'm actually going to use a different tool. I'm going to use the image editor tool right here. And then I'm going to spend a little bit of time looking at my competitors book covers, see what's kind of selling. And here I have a book cover. I think I could probably use this holiday word search one. I'll just go ahead and save that image to my computer. And I'll just head back into LitPal and I'll upload this image. And then I'm going to ask LitPal to actually modify their cover and basically create new cover art inspired by my competitor's cover art because I already know my competitor's cover art is doing well. So I'm just going to type in a prompt real quick that will modify their cover and make a new version for our book. So I just went ahead and wrote this prompt asking the AI to actually modify the image. Then I'll just mo modify the book cover. And then I'll just press uh, no specific style for the art style. And then I'll turn content visibility on to private. And then I'll just press edit image. And as you guys can see, I've actually already been using this method to create a lot of very high cover art for my previous books. And then just like that, guys, after only about a minute, I'll just go ahead and press download on the image right here. And then I'll just drag that right into my Canva document. So now that LitPal has actually made some of the main cover for us, I'm going to spend a few minutes making the cover look really nice. And I'll be right back to you guys once I'm done. Okay, so I just spent a few minutes inside of Canva and LitPal.ai and I created this really, really nice looking word search book cover. And I think it looks pretty good for a first draft. I might go in later and change up a few things. But for now, I'm really liking our holidays themed word search cover. So anyways, once we finish the cover and the interior using LitPal AI, we're going to go over to Amazon KDP's website and create the book. So it's 100% free to publish on KDP. You just have to create a KDP's account. And all we're going to do is we're going to press create new title or series. And then we're going to press create paperback. And then we're just going to fill in this entire form we put in our book title, subtitle. We'll upload the files to our cover and our interior. And in a few days, Amazon will review our book and it'll be live and for sale around the world on Amazon. Anyways, guys, that's going to wrap it up for today's tutorial. If you guys want to try out litpal.ai, it is the top link in the description. For a limited time, new users who sign up below will get a 25% discount. All you have to do to activate this discount is answer a few questions on the onboarding when you sign up and you'll be prompted with the discount. If you guys have enjoyed today's video, go ahead and subscribe. I want to get to 5,000 subscribers on YouTube and we are so, so close. Thank you guys. Lipal AI is the fastest AI book generator for Amazon KDP. So if you want to create books fast, Lipal.ai is the top link in the description. Anyways, guys, as always, stay publishing.